feel those little buggers just choo, 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 just launching around. Choo, my dad, it's one of my dicks. Welcome back to our episode. Marching up doors. Getting it. Doing it. We are currently walking across, I don't know, some random grass field. I have no idea where I'm at. But it's early. I did not film yesterday. It rained sun up to sundown. It was just miserable. Shot like 20 some ducks though. I don't care. Rain, shine, shoot them all. But we are hunting a farm pond. We've got fucking, we, my bad. <laughs> We've got fields that are just loaded down with mallards. Thousands. Can't even hunt them. It's rained for two days straight here. You know, farmers, you gotta respect the farmers. You can't just go and tear their fields up. So it's a little tiny circle in the middle of the field. Just get in there, get it done. Had the juiciest field lined up this morning. Some dude said, hey, you guys go ahead and hunt it. You found it. Well, we showed up. He was there setting up, so we don't do that game. We don't play games. We left. Go do something else, whatever. We ain't worried about it. Go sneak into these cattails. See what happens in North Dakota. I'm sure we'll shoot plenty of ducks for you guys to see. So, stay tuned. You're not going to want to miss this. Go down there, hit that subscribe button, because I'm out here doing this every day, guys. Just do it. Just do it. We'll see you there. Shoot. Shoot that one again on the water there. Watch that one going into the cattails to the right, Dad. See it down there? Just watch that. What? Oh, uh, no. Dad got it. He did. Good girl, now. Shoot that fucker. She'll get it in there. Shoot him, Dad. See him lift his wings up? Yeah. Watch it, watch it. I got it marked. Yeah, straight here. No, but I got it a line marked at least. I can hear your voice where you're at. Oh, it's a widgeon. Sexy. What? Sexy. A what? <laughs> Another one. Another one. Ta da pop. Okay. Shot 10. Wind switch. Came right in the face. We're wrapping up and uh, can move to the other side. The birds are trying to set in, but they just can't because the wind's in their face, obviously. So, bad mishap for us, but. We'll pack up, head to the other side, reset up, and uh, see if we can shoot a few more ducks. It is swampy, nasty, stinky, and uh, it's a long walk to get over there, but let's get over there, get set up, shoot some more ducks in the face. Oh. 
Oh my God, Dewey. Stop. No way. You did not. Every fucking still alive. That was, that. that was intense. Dude. Shot I got off, I was stuck in the fucking couch holes. Dude, he just pulls. I was like, I'm not even gonna shoot it that one. Dude, he pulls up and just pimping since being pimping. Watch him, watch him, watch him. Oh, he's right here. I got him marked. Now, come here. Come here, now. Come here, Come here. Come here. Find a bird. Get a bird. Get a bird now. Get a bird. Right here now. In there. In there. Get in here. Yep. Find a bird. Find a bird. Nels. Come here, Nels. Good girl. Good girl, bring her. Good girl, Mouse. Come on. Good girl. All right, that's gonna do it for us for a little bit. We're gonna get back at it though. We ain't done yet with this one. I think we uh, kind of messed up this morning. Kind of called a bad one. Sat with the wind in our face for a little bit and they'll land on the other side. It's just a big no-no, but we did it. I think we pulled a dozen out of there or something. We just picked up in a Picked up a cripple that we had on the side. We're gonna pack up the trucks, go drive around for a little bit, see if we can find some birds, and then uh, we're probably gonna do a little evening hunting. So this video ain't done yet. We'll uh, figure something out to do. Get back on the duck whacking. We are on an evening hunt. Like I said, didn't do too hot this morning. Kind of got messed up there, but now we are on another body of water here. We're gonna put the old canoe in. It's me, Dewey, my dad today or this afternoon, kind of split up, divide and conquer as you could say. We're gonna paddle all the way across this thing, get to the other side, cause that's where the juice is at, and uh, do a little evening hunt. I think it's about 1.30 right now. So the rest of the day, or until it starts really raining, cause that's gonna happen too. But enough talking, pond's black. Let's get out there, start whacking some more ducks, man. Right here. Oh, yes, yes, how did I miss, dude, that was terrible, dude. Terrible shooting on my part right there, that's all we want him to do it, though, uh-huh, he did it. And he did. Well, I just had my cam. Dude, didn't have my camera on. Yeah. No, I didn't have it on. Well, I just bagged me a tundra swan. <laughs> Look at this sucker here, boys. It's the one! <laughs> he's yellow! I'm talking, he's yellow! Dude! Dude! I can't believe I didn't have my camera on. How dumb is that? Alright guys. Look at this. Yeah. You boy just shot a shot me a big old thunder swan look at that big old thunder swan this is totally legit here in north dakota i am i uh, got one to get one tag per person and that's a draw type deal and i got my tag this year and i shot me an absolute true mondo swan right there first things first we'll get a tag on this guy i did not get it on footage i'm highly highly disappointed about the whole deal but I mean, 
it's once in a lifetime. You get a chance, the camera's kind of the last thing you're worried about. So I pulled up and I folded them. I mean, look at this thing. That's what North Dakota's all about. Big swans and lots of ducks. Let's put them in the bag. I didn't either, I just heard it. So did I, and I was looking for it. I know, that's that shoveler. Yeah, it's a shoveler, all right. I see it go around and I lost it. Sometimes you just gotta take them up the booty when they come over the top. Is that Dewey? And I looked up and there he was. And to put it right up the old scooter. All right, as you can tell, I am in the canoe. We're not seeing a bunch of birds where we're at, so. I'm gonna hop in the canoe and rip down to this corner over here. Set up for a little bit, because uh, there's been a bunch of birds going over there, so. I'm gonna go over there solo. See if I can get some of these teal. Talk about turning both of those to gumbo. <clears throat> yeah. <laughs> oh, there's two more. Two more want to do it. Oh, that's not good. I feel kind of bad. That's what happens when you miss a few times. You start putting it on point, and let me tell you. First shot was a little behind on those, but my next two were absolutely ridiculous. All right, guys, that's gonna do it for me today. I'm gonna head back. I shot a lot of shells and not hit a lot of ducks. I don't know what happened today, but one good thing happened today. I got my swan, I'm super happy. Super pumped to get my swan, North Dakota. He's gracious enough to give you a swan tag if you can draw it. And I drew it, and my dad got one too yesterday. So it's been a good trip. We've shot lots of ducks. A lot of rain, rain for two days straight. That kind of put us out of the fields. Got to respect the farmers, like I said a million times now. Got to respect them. They don't want you in the field, they don't want you in the field. Simple as that. So we're gonna pack it up, try and go scout for a little bit. It's supposed to snow tonight, so we're gonna see if any more new birds are moving in. Try and line up a field if we can, that'd be nice, but I've missed way too many green wing too. Those little buggers are just, just launching around. I can't hit them, so I'm gonna get out of here. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode of Martial Outdoors. Make sure to hit that like button, smash that subscribe button, just smash it because I love the duck hunting. Hopefully you guys do too. And uh, lots of hunting videos coming. Sorry, my head's on a swivel. That's what happens when you're in the duck line. But. Drop a comment down below. Let me know if you guys are enjoying these duck hunting videos from North Dakota. We're going to get out of here. Go do some scouting. Like I said, we will see you tomorrow.